Section 1.5, calculating income, and this is with the method of commission. So if you're uh, selling a house, a car, big ticket items get paid by commission. Um, so we're going to be using a lot of percents in this, and that's why the try these um, is calculating percent. So remember, 5% is 0 0.05 times 12,200. So um, you can use your calculator for these. So 0 0.05 times 12,200, 610. Now, if you forget the percent, uh, how to convert, remember it's 5%, that's like 100, so it's 5 out of 100 is at 0 0.05. Next one, 2 out of the 100 is 0 0.02 times by 3,250 is 65. 1.5% is 0.015 times 9,420. Uh, it's money, so put the zero at the end. 0 0.023 uh, times 150. 45, okay. All right, first one, Ali is a real estate agent earning straight commission. His commission rate is 4% of the selling price of each home he sells. This month he sold two homes. What was his commission? So uh, there are the two homes. Total value, so you can do them separately, but you might. it's the same commission rate, so might as well just add them together first. Um, so we will move this over. 255,000 plus 304,999 is uh, $559,999, okay? Then what is the amount of commission? So the amount means the dollar price, not the percent. So we want us to take 4% of 559,999. That'll be the commission. So um, it's going to be, I've already got that total amount there, so I can just press times 0 0.04. All right, so that's $22,399.96 in commission. All right, if it asks for the total well, it's not going to ask for the total plus um, the commission rate in this case. So we're never going to add the 4% to the uh, to 100% because he doesn't get paid this. That's, the, that's for the house. He just gets paid this commission rate. Okay. Next one, Sabina is a salesperson at Electronics Empire, base salary of 340 a week. So that often happens. You get a base amount so that if you sell nothing, you still get some money coming in. Um, then she earns 1.5 commission on the total values of the goods she sells. So here are her sales for the two parts of the month, gross income for the month. So um, in this case, we're going to, so here, the workbooks assumes four weeks in the month. Technically, not, there aren't, right? 31 days in a month um, or 30 days in a month is more than four weeks, but we'll do what they are approximating here. So four weeks times $340 per week. And on a test, we'll specify um, if there's certain number of weeks and that kind of thing. So we don't have to worry too much. Okay, so that will be approximately how much for the month. And then um, I'm just, while we're here, I'm just going to add these up because it's on the next page. You can see it on your workbook. Uh, I'm going to just add these up right now. So 55,340 plus 75,920. Okay, so that's going to go on the next page. So go to the next page. Total of the sales, that's what I just did. So I added these together and 
and then we have to take 1.5 commission of that. So 0 0.015 of the total sales. So if it's already in your calculator, just press multiply 0 0.015, and that's $1,968.90. And so we want to add that to the total for the four weeks, which was 1360 so again, you can just press add in any calculator, the 1360, or I can go up and copy it out. It should be $3,328.90. Okay. Um, so that is a common thing that you might get a base salary. Now, the thing is, um, if you're not selling anything, you're not going to get the commission. So that hurts you um, and your employer is not going to be very happy with you right so um, you do need to think about that you can't just coast along getting the base salary and then example two Jasmine sells clothing part-time at BB's boutique gets a monthly salary 950 no matter what she sells 4% commission on the first 15,000 dollars of her sales and then if she sells over that the amount over that she gets 6%. So this is really called step commission. And I'll show you why it's sometimes called that. So Jasmine's total sales were 28,200. What was her gross income for the month? So you want to keep it in, uh, basically look at it in parts. And here's where the steps come in. So I draw a set of steps, right? Just like, stairs steps and for the first step um, she gets four percent commission um, for any sales up to fifteen thousand dollars okay the next step she gets six percent for anything more than that so here that would be the difference of twenty-eight thousand two hundred and 15,000. Okay, so that would be what would be 13,200. That's what she's going to get 6% on, not the total amount, because that would be basically getting commissioned twice. So first step is the for the first uh, rate. And then the next rate is the second step. Sometimes you might have four steps, this just has two, but you got to calculate that difference. So base salary for the month that was already given to us, it was $950. Commission for $15,000 in sales, that's 4% of $15,000. So here, 4% 0 0.04 times 15, oops, 15,000 is 600. Commission for sales over, that's 6%. And this is, we've already done this subtraction, but that's where we take the 28,200, subtract the 15,000, that was 13,200. And so now we, um, we multiply, uh, uh, sorry, 0 0.06 times 13,200, and that's $792. And then we add all of these up, 950, 600, 792. I've already got the 792, so I'm gonna go plus 600 plus 950, 2,342. Okay, so that's called step commission. So the biggest thing is to realize that when you're taking the 6%, it's of the difference between those steps, okay? And last thing I want to do is not, uh, is a question that I made up that I want to do. Um, there's a little bit of space. Hopefully we can squish it in there. Um, yeah, if there's enough space. You can even write it underneath the diagram. So Timmy wants to earn $4,000 next month. Timmy earns a base salary of $1,000 a month plus 10% commission on sales, how much would he have to sell in order to earn a $4,000 goal? So it's kind of a working backwards question. 
So uh, pause the video if you need to copy this down. Um, but let's get started on this. So he needs to earn 4,000. For sure he will earn 1,000. So first of all, his um, commission earnings need to be the difference of those, 4,000 minus 1,000. So $3,000, okay? And then let's think about how to calculate commission. This is not a step commission. He straight gets 10% on all of his sales. And we wanna know um, how, what, how much he has to sell, okay? So think about that 10%, 0 0.1 times his sales has to equal 3,000. Really, it's just an, an easy equation that you've solved for a few years now. Sales will equal, so the opposite of multiplying is dividing. Okay, so 3,000 divided by 0 0.1 is going to need to be $30,000 in sales. Okay, so it's a working backwards, and I think you'll see one of the, these in the practice. Okay, that's it for 1.5.